<laughs> the practice round to the USAM is here. We're about to get on the road. I'm gonna go properly film nine holes and kind of keep track of what I shoot. If you guys are new here, my name's Luke Peavy. Welcome to my channel. I love you guys. Hit that subscribe button, like the video. Most importantly, hit that notification bell. Bangers every week. Let's get after it. <laughs> SamBeckerGolfCo.com. Alrighty, so we're coming here through the gate. Right down Magnolia Lane here, boys. It's okay, it's pretty cool. High grass. Okay. Okay. Let's go see. It looks like a link style. I didn't even know that. Uh-oh. A little different. This is no TPC. Let's park it down here in the shade. Big dad move. Always park in the shade, son. Alright, so we have made it. Got a little clock there. That's how you know it's pretty fancy. The greens are a little hairy. And you guys know we don't like hairy. We want fast greens. This course just looks hilly as freak. Looks like a link style course, so interesting. See what this course is all about. I just hammered that. And I still didn't get it there. Standard club. Pretty sick little logo. Look at it. Logo, probably six out of 10. Same bagger logo. 10 out of 10. <laughs> Nobody can beat that one. What do we got here? A little snack shop right before the front. No way this is free. No shot. Are there cameras up here? No shot. Whoa, dude. Dude, look. Lunch? No shot. You know, Kevin, they're not gonna have this on the USAM day because they're gonna be like, you guys aren't getting that. I got the tees that I'm actually gonna be playing. The guy gave it to me inside. Let's see what tees we are playing. I still can't believe they gave free snacks and drink, Powerade. We're gonna be playing Silvers, which is, I think the back. Oh yeah, that's back, back, back. There's only three holes we're not playing all the way back. I'm excited to show you guys this golf course. Last year, if you guys saw, I did make it to the second round. I shot 70 in the first round and I was sitting top I think I was T7 and top five get in. And then the second round I shot like, I think my worst score of the year, 80. We're gonna give it a run this year and I'm feeling good. Game feels good. I hope you guys are ready to get along with this freaking run. Let's go, let's go. All right, let's see y'all. Alrighty, short part four. You know, this may be my first hole, so we're gonna go three wood because I love this thing right now. Tee boxes, pristine. Course conditions are better than ideal. And I hit it freaking money. That was perfect. All right, I absolutely split this fairway. That was the best I honestly could have hit this ball. 113 downhill. Perfect, perfect position. Playing about 110 wedge. a little far but got a nice little birdie chance i love this course already bent greens soft conditions go time <laughs> let's go first bird of the day that was from matthew fitzpatrick and the sandbagger nation baby sandbaggergolfco.com Good enough. It's in play. Perfect stinger. The buttery cut around that, just right in that bunker. I love a fade. 
butter cuts, fades, you name it, I love them. Like, this is a course I feel like people are gonna go pretty low on. Pretty good shot. That was a really good shot. Got about an eight footer here. So far, it's been, the start must be a, a little bit easier. So, hey, two under through three. That's pretty good. Long par four, that's where it starts to get interesting. But hey, if you get off of that good start right there, it makes it a little bit easier on this thread. That was a straight ball. All right, we got 178. Full chip shot, but hey, we're learning on these chip shots. It's a little different than the TPC, that's for sure. Uh, that could be dangerous. Looks a little right. It looked a little right, but. Also, I didn't know where the flag was, kind of. This is probably going to be a super tough up and down now. Oof. You should see the slopes out here. That is one thing. It's a slopey course. Really just over this hump. And it's a bigger hump than it looks like on camera. These are some big humps. My hump's my hump. Yeah, it's tough. No, it's not very bad. It kind of caught a lot of spin. But this is definitely makeable. Those are what are huge. And the good thing about this shot right here was that the greens are a little bit hairy right now. So it kind of made it a little bit easier to stop it because if these were any faster, that thing would have been way back here. But hey, created a little spin, got it to check just a tad, and the slow greens kind of helped me there. Let's go, let's go. This was definitely a better miss right here because it's kind of flat. It looked a lot more steep, but it's actually pretty flat over here. That was a lot quicker than I anticipated. Nope. Just blasted it through, man. Blasted it through. First bogue of the day. Ah, it's frustrating, man. That was piped. How did that come all day? Got 215 out on this part five. Gonna hit a nice little buttery fade up in there. I kind of bounced a little hard. No bueno. Yeah. Let's go. The putter is fuego, man. I missed like one putt all day. I'll tell you what, boys. Spending a day with the STX. Go watch that video if you haven't. Uh, something got into her, man. She's been red hot today. It feels good just to play good in front of the camera in a while. I haven't been playing that good, but hey, I'm getting it back, boys. I'm getting it back. 166 down the hill, hole in one material here. What the heck was that? Dude, that was the weirdest sound ever. That sounded so weird. It felt like I hit a rock. Maybe the ball's bad. No excuse there, but that was weird. That was really weird. Let's check this ball. That was the weirdest sound I have ever. Dude, no shot. It, it's cracked. That ball literally just cracked. What? I knew I was not tripping. That is cracked. Oh, 
Just missed it. A little long, came out hot. That was a weird hole. Well, that was a weird hole. Bogey, back to one under, cracked ball. Wow, that's a first. Never cracked a ball like that, just from swinging. What makes a ball crack? Comment below, why does it crack like that? Hot day in Georgia, man. I still can't get over that freaking crack ball, dude. You know, I've been working out a good bit. Really been laying down on the, the weights. 196. A little left over the bunker, though. All right, missed another green. That's what I've seen, like, I haven't been hitting that many greens lately. All right, so that is the front nine here at the Standard Club, and that's gonna do the USM practice round because I'm just gonna get a little bit more practice on the back nine and just kind of see it through. But uh, yeah, you guys saw it. I shot one under, pretty solid, pretty, pretty solid. It's a tough track. Um, definitely a little bit tougher after the first few holes, but if you hit good drives, it's, it's out there, it's out there. Thank you guys for watching as always. Hope you enjoyed that front nine. I did. Hopefully we can duplicate that in the USAM qualifier. <sighs> Hype me up. I'm doing it for the boys. Always like, subscribe, visit Sandbagger Golf Co. Hit that notification bell. I'll see you guys in the next video. Whoop. Let's go.